up, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the Midnight Suns. I am your host, Kenny Eastlick. Where last left off, we were fighting, uh... Wait, what's this do? Oh, no, that isn't... Wait, wait, shouldn't I help... Actually, shouldn't I help Blade? No, I don't. I want me to do that. Wait, do I? I see you. Ooh, what's the hero? Do you smell the container? Okay. Um. Do. I... How do I help Blade? I could probably use that. Welcome assistance. Let me show you those. I missed the part where I'm supposed to heal or break blade out of that. Do I look a bit younger to you? <laughs> no, that won't do any good. Neither will that. And the churn. Look how fragile you are. Die. Ooh. Oh. Ah. Ah, crap. We haven't quite broken their spirit yet. When a human is stunned, they will not act as churn. I'm saying it takes damage to her. Oh, okay. We may not be ready for this thing yet. Might be smarter to pull back until we know what we're up against here. Yes. Surrender. Be. Fill our belly with your tasty I shall fill your belly with my blade. Uh. By the will of the old gods. Well, that wasn't a KO. Apparently our reputation isn't enough to scare off these so-called children of Lilith. No. Eat my axe. May the house of our countries join us faster than I say. Yeah. Oh. That should do something. Won't end well for you. Oh. No time to lick our wounds. I'm gonna move over here. I forget how to free blade. It's remarkable how well Hydra manages to attract new recruits despite decades of ineptitude. You are within our reach. Uh oh. That punch left a resident. Ah, crap. Hey. Mother blesses us with power. Mother blesses us with strength. We protect the mother and are rewarded with your meat. And to think Lilith was a vegetarian. <laughs> Ooh. Ah, uh, bad idea. Carry you on. 
welcome assistance. Let's see. Over there is something. This should aid me in my fight. Ooh. Doctor and a powerful wizard. Impressive. That's not gonna do us any good. Good. The only thing stronger than its oh. fists is its breath. Ooh. I think I made him mad. Oh crap. Lilith oh. really want me out of the picture. What I do, what I do, what I do. You should not have come here, Melander. Your friends cannot help you. Mother may have claim on your soul. But your brains shall be ours. Does... <sighs> I'm afraid to do that. Actually, you know what? Let's, let's do a quick save. Just in case I accidentally kill Blade here. I don't care about the knockback part. Just freaking... Oh my gosh. Who gives two craps... Your fate is sealed. Okay, that's all I needed to do. I didn't know if that free blade or not. That's all I needed. Not so tough after all. No escape from me, demon. Hold up. We don't know what we're dealing with yet. <laughs> Ooh. I just got body slammed. Spiderly. It's the thing about the voice to him in the Spider-Man game. I was in the neighborhood, you know, being friendly. It seemed like you folks could use a hand, Doc. <laughs> Spider-Man! Jeez, Eddie, what happened to you? That's sort of a horrifyingly terrible new look. The tongue was gross enough, but... Whoa! Someone is extra touchy today. We will rip your face off and suck the marrow from your bones! Gross. Always nice to see you too, buddy. So, I'm thinking your friends here could use a little break. How about I take Eddie here for his afternoon walk? <laughs> Don't worry, Doc. That's just his way of saying he cares! <laughs> One. One star. Gamma Coil. Oh. Wait. What? Oh, okay, okay, I see. Mission complete, mission a train. Ooh, yeah. We don't we don't we don't talk about strange getting knocked out. Congratulations. New world or not, some things remain unchanged. The look. What <clears throat> look? Boldly charging headfirst into the jaws of your enemy. 
Courageously risking the lives of yourself and your teammates. Just to play the hero. This is the fire dragon all over again. Ooh, fire dragon. Dragon. My memories may be fragmented, but as I recall, I killed the bastard. I found so sophisticated. A village. Oh, of course. I see it now. The look. Cut him some slack. It wasn't that simple. It never is. Which is why I sent you to help. If Spider-Man hadn't come along today, we could have lost far more than... Than the Sanctum? Or Wanda. She means I could have died. Again. Putting an end to her eternal crusade against my mother. You've been through a lot. For now, it's enough that you all made it back in one piece. More or less. We'll talk oh, that more first later. outing was fun. Get some rest. Talk to Stark. Okay. <clears throat> He is there. Strange blade. Caretaker. Myself. What's that? Oh, right. That, that's where I was. Hadoi. Not to be the nagging old lady, but I told you not to push too hard. Now that things have settled down, you should get some rest. It won't always be this quiet. Thank you. Because <laughs> I would need that. Oh, don't want to jump. That was a complete fiasco. You did okay out there, considering you were technically dead 72 hours ago. Not bad, Hunter. Not bad at all. An impressive first outing, just as I had expected. You're going to do great things, Hunter. Thanks. And it would have been far worse had Spider-Man not arrived when he did. No kidding. Caretaker would have been pissed if Venom had actually eaten a hunter. Yes, one disaster averted. But we still need to figure out how to get Wanda and the Sanctum back. You done talking? Good, because I was walking away. Hunter, you look scathed. Hey, for what it's worth, I think you did okay out there. You got some decent hang time, even uh, given you were wearing, what, 70, 80 pounds of chain mail? On the stark scale of reckless yet daring heroics, I give it a solid 6 out of 10. Don't worry, you'll get there, with a little help. What's with the mustache? Your support is appreciated. Oh, no problem. Already got a few ideas cooking. You're not allergic to mimetic poly... You know what? Never mind. Why spoil the surprise? I, I couldn't help but overhear Auntie Caretaker over there telling you to get some rest. That uh, sounds like a good idea to me. I suppose I could keep you company on the way, seeing as our rooms are in the same direction and all. Besides, no one should be forced to walk the hallways around here alone. Why do things jump out and go boo? So, here we are. The old room, huh? It's, uh, it's not bad. Functional. Solid construction. Almost cozy. Love the antique furnishings from the early Mephisto collection. <coughs> For transparency, Hunter, there's another reason I asked to join you here. Other than my abject terror of this entire facility. Stopped here before, while you were out. Wanted to surprise you with a nice little housewarming present. Was all set to write you a lovely welcome note, but I'm fairly certain that wasn't red ink in your quill. Ooh, drop joke. I do not have a quill. Even better. <laughs> Relax, Tony. I simply jest. It is an ink derived of the spider lily flower. Red spider lily flowers. Of course it was. Obviously. With just a touch of Manphibian blood for power. There it is. Haha, <laughs> another zinger. And we'll just leave it at that. 
Well, I suppose I should leave before whatever monstrosity that is most definitely hiding under your bed jumps out, rips my face off, and then proceeds to feast on my soul. I'll leave you to it. May your sleep be filled with pleasant dreams, Tony. Right back at you. Oh, and if you hear the shrieking of a grown man, please ignore it. It's just me, walking to my room. <laughs> Yay, a present. Oh, and Iron Man is now available. Oof. Interesting family portrait. Hmm? Hmm. Okay, then. Hi, I'm Tony Stark. But if you're hearing this message, you already know that. Super and I'm not saving the world. I ah. solve the world's problems with technological means, like the one you're holding. I call it the Spark. A secure information and communication device built <laughs> only for superheroes. Yes, it does all the usual. Private messages, pictures... Yes, I can. For some reason. But That's it also comes with again. access to Superlink, a private social network exclusively for your cape-wearing, world-saving compatriots. Where's you might ask, nice? Tony, aren't you just repurposing a failed product from your communications division? If you do, I'll revoke access and let everyone else know you're a jerk. I call it the Wonder Man rule. <laughs> Let's see, I show you this on the case. She went and sent you a protection. Oh, wrong thing. Messages. That's cool. That's cool. Wait, what? Oh, yeah. I'm going to add it to my favorites. Because the first one would be on it. Favorites. Photo booth. Photo mode. Postcards. Interesting. Map. Blade. Doctor Strange. Iron Man. Me? Oh, there's a chapel. Cool. Inspect journal page, closet, and painting. What? Oh. Ants are also practice my letters, and so here I am, but every time I dip pen and ink, I just want more and more to go out beyond the yard in my secret spot, so if my dolls scatter around before the storm, I'm afraid to hurt your dolls, hold grudges, I guess that they don't, but I still feel sad for them. Hmm. My old journal. Maybe it is time I start writing in it again. Uh Ah, here we go. We were all so happy then. Oh. Okay. There's Interact. Never enough room for my armor in this thing. Okay, gl gloss. Our information is concerned. I like new cosmetic up to 100 heroes, including outfits, who are on the Abbey. Oh. Okay. 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 I got a hundred, so kind of like that one. Just add it to your inventory. Let's see, my hand. Oh, dope! Oh, what? How do I? Oh, because I don't own anything. Okay. Oh, that's kind of cool. So I could change that in the future. Room upgrades. More gloss required, blah, blah, blah. <clears throat> Just <laughs> the finer things in my bedroom. Cool. Aw oh, man, I have to unlock a new bed. That sucks. Go to sleep. Going to sleep. Do you not sleep under the covers? Oh, 
Oh, magical bright white light. We must fall back. Aware. The book. Is she reading from the book? Then we advance. No. Hold the line. I can stop her. Only I can stop her. Ish. You ugly. Oh. Hello. Charlie. I know, I know. I I missed you too. Let her enjoy the moment. She's been visiting your door every morning for the past 300 years. Oh, Dang. It must have been so hard on her. Not just her. I You're old too late. I might have been a little curt before. A little. You already made the ultimate sacrifice once. No rush to see you I mean, again. scary demon dog. You must so choose our destiny. But we can choose to duck. <laughs> First lesson you ever taught me. And still the most important. Especially now that you have all these eyes on you. I have noticed. To these people, you are a being of myth and legend. A grand hero of old. And they're right. You are a hero. But I also know the battle that rages within your soul. It's not enough that you are a hero. You need to decide what type of hero you will be. Anti-hero. I'm sure there will be plenty of opportunity for that in the days to come. For now, I would head to the forge. Our new guests are eager to show you something. Or is it puppy? This was a lot easier when it was just you and I beheading the Dark Legion as we traipsed through the woods. Don't forget about Agatha. I never could. I wonder if she died in this universe. Ooh, a new post. Uh, oh. Let's see. Spider-Man is a friend of the from City, Garish, Bleecker Street Manor, Sale of Authorities, and Spider-Man is. Pet Amos is a child that sucks their gun which village. Not a disgrace. Surgeon Stephen Strange. He's coots with the web sling and wrongdoer. Garish, but I hate you who it's paper. <laughs> you mentioned the article. Pajama clad friends. Still a thing based on police radio chatter we intercepted. So they're closing in on Little Italy. Doubt they're stopping for a slice. Everyone knows that it's about the linguini and. Cl Ugh, that sounds gross. Gabagool. I met a Gabagool. <laughs> not want to invoke one of these right now. So, Spider Man. Not that easy. These boys move too damn fast. Keep at it. Even in New York City, those two stand out. Well, yeah. So, what did I say today? I leave a credit of a sludge monster. Give me a say for say it. He is the astounding. I thought it was amazing. He had too many words. Where's the writer Blue Chill Sweet? Spider Man is no joke. Wow, look at somebody made a friend. More like an enemy of an enemy. Starting to think we could use more of those. There's the old Avengers. Tolerate your spooky, strange teammate attitude looking for. And I was going for this month's Team Spirit Award. I have to go train. I, I like that. Just, I, I'm going to go train. Heroes. Ooh, right. Customize. Default. Oh, yeah, that's the one that I uh, got from pre-ordering. I like his original outfit though. He looks too much like Ghost Rider there. I didn't need to see that. Oh, okay. The oh, it's a swimsuit. Okay, that that's that's not as bad. I mean, I don't need to see that, but okay. All right, I got that too. Hmm. His default costume does look pretty cool and it's pretty iconic. However, that looks kind of cool too. It's it's like literally the same. What about Iron Man? That's not a tux. Oh, it's all the same stuff. Okay. 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 That looks cool. 
Let's go bleeding edge for Iron Man. What about me? Do I have anything? Oh, wait. What? Profile? Ah, uh, that's cool. Nope. Can I pet the pu- I can pet the puppy. Girl, Charlie. Oh, it's a puppy. Can I pet the puppy again? Pet the puppy again. Can I pet the puppy some more? Who is a good girl? It is my Charlie girl. I'm gonna continue to pet the puppy. Pet the puppy! Oh, my sweet girl. At some point, I'm gonna have to continue the game. I will see if I can find you a treat later. That's what, six times? There's a trophy for like 15 doggy pets. I'm just gonna continue to pet the doggy. Feeling good today, girl? There is my Let's see, that's Charlie eight. Hey, Nine pets. Barley, puppy face. The heck? Nine. You have not said anything on fire. Ted. Wait, what? Eleven. What you doing, Charlie? Twelve. The best girl. You know that, right? No, I mean, I won't not pet the dog after this. I'm just, you know, counting. Good girl, Was it Thirteen. Charlie. Who's a good girl? It is my Charlie girl. And Fifteen. Hello, my sweet girl. I used to think it's fifteen, or maybe that wasn't fifteen. I will see if I can find you. Ah, uh, it cycles through. Hmm. I'll have to check the trophy later. I gotta continue on, puppy. I'm not sure we've ever had so many eager new recruits come along in such a short time. We must be doing something right. Or maybe you just suck. Next thing I know, the sanctum is airborne and covered in slime. Let's talk later, Hunter. Tony will start pouting if you keep him waiting too long. Something about the hope. Heard about what happened in New York, Hunter. I'm sure whatever Tony's cooking up down there will only help. Do I look like a Tony? No. Not that it makes any difference to me, but I think Tony's waiting for you, Hunter. He seemed excited. I will come back for that essence. Oh, hey. I'm a vampire. I see everything. <sighs> this is going to be a fun apocalypse. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> Looking fly as ever. Now? Think you can tell your friend inside there to turn it up a few hundred Kelvin? I could. However, it might shatter the containment spell preventing him from incinerating this facility. Uh, I think we're good. And just in time. The forge has certainly changed. Right. Caretaker said this all happened after your siesta. What spooky castle would be complete without its own Babylonian demon-powered furnace? Sumerian fire demon. His name is Babs. Oh, <coughs> now it all makes sense. Well, once you get past the esoteric terror of the situation, I found this thing actually has some uses. Molecular bonding, breaking down evil gamma serums, fashion accessorizing... Mm, yes, speaking of... Oh, right. It's ready. <laughs> Sumerian fire demon, his name is Babs. Your armor seemed to offer minimal protection against the venom creature. I noticed. Yeah, I thought you could use an upgrade. Sweet. Well, well fired. Caretaker did not mention that you two are such skilled 
Smithies. Yep, I am Iron Smithy. <laughs> Perhaps you should just try it on. Whatever you say, Dr. Spooky. Interesting. Still think I could have used a cloak. Eh, I'm not a cloak kind of guy. Cool. Stop. That was actually damn near indestructible, and we even got the size right. Not bad for our first collaboration. That's actually perfect timing. So that is all the time I have for this episode. So that's it. Thank you all so much for watching. Please hit the like button if you want to see more of Marvel's Midnight Suns. Be sure to hit the subscribe button to get that notification. And I will see you guys around.